Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Arsenal are thinking about cashing in on star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang at the end of the season and Manchester United were said to be leading a pack of Premier League sides interested in the striker. Liverpool have also been tentatively linked with making a move for the Gabon international. Sadio Mane and Mohamed Salah will miss large periods of next season due to their participation in the African Cup of Nations. Therefore Jurgen Klopp is expected to bolster his attacking options at the end of the season. Obama Yang is out of contract next summer so the Gunners may look to regain around £50 million for their top scorer. However, Heskey does not think the 30-year-old would be a good fit at Anfield, despite his terrific prolificacy in front of goal. Pierre-Emerick Obama Yang is a wonderful goal-getter, Heskey told Genting Bet. His stats are amazing. He is showing time and time again that he is a goal-scorer. He's playing in an Arsenal side that isn't really fancied in and around the league but he's going out and scoring week in and week out. He's challenging for the golden boot. He's Mr. Consistent. But, will he fit in the Liverpool system? Probably not. I don't think that he would be an ideal fit for Liverpool. Arsenal's preferred option would be to hand Obama Yang a contract extension but they will find that difficult without being able to offer European football. Mikel Arteta's side are ninth in the Premier League table and are set to miss out on the Champions League and Europa League places. Mesut Ozil is Arsenal's current top earner and club legend Paul Merson fears that could be another issue in Obama Yang talks. It would be a major disaster for Arsenal if they lost to Obama Yang, however, the decision will be weighed up and at least it will be the club's decision as to what they do, he told Sky Sports. Do they give him £300,000 a week? I've always said they will have a problem until Mesut Ozil leaves the club. Every day he's there, every other top player will want what he's on. It's a huge problem and not a new one. If they want to keep Obama Yang they will have to pay him big money, but Arsenal may look at it and think if we give him £300,000 a week for the next two or three years, is he going to be the same player? He's nearly 31 and by the time he's 34 he's not going to be the same player. I don't care who you are, at 34 you are not the same player. Arsenal may also wait up asking if they will win the Premier League or get into the top four in the next few years if they pay Obama Yang £300,000 a week. They haven't actually done it yet with him there, so they may look at it and say it is good business to let him go. Let's block ads. Why?